All right, well, we start off with some clouds this morning and we had some showers roll through. But as we take a look at Super Doppler 8, that wet weather is pushed onto the south. We're actually seeing the clouds thin out very nicely. And you can see that here on our Hershey Sky Cam. Some sunshine there in the distance and dry conditions. Roads looking good there. The forecast for the rest of the day. Partly sunny skies, temperatures in the low to mid 80s. Still can't rule out a stray shower this afternoon, but most everybody will stay dry. You will notice it turning sticky a little later as dew points continue to climb as the humidity starts to build across the area. Overnight tonight, partly cloudy, mild and muggy. Temperatures in the upper 60s to near 70 degrees, certainly milder for sure. Clouds and sun tomorrow and scattered afternoon, late afternoon and early evening thunderstorms will be possible. It is an impact day tomorrow because some of those storms will have the ability to become uh, st strong or severe with the heat and humidity and a cold front coming in. Perfect ingredients there for these storms. Uh, we are in a slight risk, which is a two on a scale of one to five. The main threats will be damaging winds and the possibility of flash flooding. These storms will be slow movers and will have the potential to put down some heavy rain that will continue just to increase across the same locations. Tornado threats not zero, um, so we could have a spin up. We'll have to keep a close eye on these storms as they do develop. We also are in a slight risk for the flood threat tomorrow, and that is just because of the fact that these storms could be slow moving. Temperatures right now, we're in the 70s, mid to upper 70s, and they're going to continue to climb. We've got some thicker clouds off to the west, keeping temperatures in the 60s, but we'll see some thinning there, and that sunshine will come out. Dew points are in the 50s, still comfortable, but off to the west, they're a little bit higher, and we are going to see these numbers climbing as we go further into the afternoon hours. It's going to feel quite sticky later on, and that stickiness stays with us the rest of the week. So summer arrived early this morning, and it is here for sure, <laughs> weather-wise too. Uh, we've got this warm front here that triggered some of those showers earlier. The cold front still off to the west, but as I show you on our predictor here, it will be moving eastward and as it moves into this very warm and humid environment, that will be uh, the perfect setup for some of these storms to develop. Most of the day is dry tomorrow. There might be an isolated shower in the morning, but we get the sunshine going and then as we head into the afternoon hours, we see these storms uh, starting to develop and move in across the area. They should be out here by 9 or 10 o'clock and then we're looking at high pressure to build in and bring us a pretty decent day as we head into Thursday. It's just going to be very warm and humid. Here's your 10 day forecast 84 for today. Some areas may get a little bit warmer depending on how quickly that sunshine uh, increases 86 for tomorrow with those strong storms 84 on Thursday. We're in the mid 80s on Friday. It's still quite warm heading into the weekend. In fact, could see temperatures in the upper 80s to near 90 degrees. It is dry but humid. Next best chance for storms arrives Monday.